What's going on, yo? It's BH Gaming here, and I'm back with another one. And yes, we are here on this division. This is another video. As you see before, I had the uh, I had the defense gear set, the review. I had the update. I had the Tommy Gun showcase. I had the um. I think that was it and the Larry Brown chess piece review I'm sorry there was no audio on that but um there was another video coming up or there should be another video out already um about it so yeah but um this is a review on the one and only no it's not the short bow knee pads because I ain't got them yet but they I do have the Colonel Biz holster now this holster hmm <laughs> I could see this holster being um, very not used um, as much and if you, unless you can get a beautiful roll. Now, the reason I say this is because like the talent itself is cool. Don't get me wrong. Because this holster hitting a target consecutively with a side arm increases your weapon damage by two percent for twenty seconds. This affects stacks until 10 shots after which the stack is consumed and triggers an EMP. Now if I can find a target. Let's go and kill a boss. Over here. You see someone's killing the PvE bosses over there. There's a bus over there actually. So um. Let's go ahead. So, well I could have gone and do Bullet King. But I'll show you all what the uh, effect does. So what it does use your pistol and pistol only. You hit that one target, I believe. I, I'm not sure if you can swap targets. Like you shoot one, five, and shoot on five, and they hit both. But I think it's one target only, and then triggers the EMP. I have to really check that. But um, so I could see this being this build. See, you see my pistol that I got has harmful in it. Now, if I get have harmful, and I have that with the sentry call, and have this holster. So I say I have that like one, two, three, maybe Sanji cool there. So three piece Sanji, four piece Sanji cool, and I use the, the holster, and I have I'm here putting the marks on people with the shield build. I'm here putting the marks on people while um while people are bleeding and they can't use their skill. That is cheese, b. See, there's the boss come out. I know his goons. Let's kill his goons and I'll, uh, I'll show y'all what, what it does. I'm gonna destroy you through that bullet shield. So I don't want to kill that boss yet. So what happens is this boss will leave me alone for a second. Let's go back and have a look at it. It says hitting the target because with your sidearm increases your weapon damage of your sidearm, I believe, for 20 seconds. And then the effect for 10 shots is the EMP. Oh. So if I show you, if you look in the the HUD, not hitting with the uh, three shots four shots five that's ten shots right, so ten you. shots triggers the EMP you see that on the with the bleed up on the right so here he is a uh, easy to use the skills and you see my weapon uh, you see the stack at the bottom is draining so if I hit him it keeps it up Just keeps up the, the weapon damage you see the damage goes up then it, when it gets to ten it triggers the EMP resets so if I uh, let it finish, if I let it drain right, out, and uh, I'll show you, I'll show you uh, the base damage of it. So the base damage of this pistol, it's 15.9. Now I, I shoot him. Let's say I shoot him five times. That's five. And the damage of the pistol should go up, 17.3. Now I doesn't know if it counts for weapons. Oh, it does. It counts for weapons too. Oh, that's crazy. 
I didn't know it counts for your main weapons as well. Ooh, so. So I didn't know that. But you know, it's what we're here to test these things out with. So let's say you uh, shoot your target, you got the shield bit out. Or maybe not even shield, but you hit your target with, with the 10. And then you see my weapon damage, or my pistol go to 22.1k. This is 18.7. That's a lot, cause with the uh, if I had Covington with his MP5, I triggered that. Use the skill. My weapon damage would just shoot up, and then you see at the bottom goes back. I should check. My uh, level will go back to 21, and my MP5 go back to 17. So this host is crazy, man. It's crazy. It's crazy. Nah, nah. It's too crazy. But um, where's this bitch? At? He's out in the back there. So um, here we go. So I didn't know that. So the EMP. I think the max when it gets to the max. Oh yeah. See, it's weird. One minute it was working, that minute it's not working. Um, it's interesting. Hmm. So you see, it, it glitches out and glitches on. I don't know. As you know, that's what everything that happens here. But my pistol damage goes up, as you see. I guess because it's a. Uh, it ran out. Let's see. Dealing with the bleed in the. Uh, my pistol damage going up to 16.7. And my elbow is going up to 22.1. Okay, so it does work until it runs out, that is. Until it drains out. So if I hit him again with the pistol, we gotta keep up the, uh, the damage. Whoa, 24.2. So if I keep if I keep hitting them again, okay, it, I guess it resets. So every time you do it, it resets. So that's that's interesting to know. So you can stack it, I guess. Um, but it says it doesn't stack. So I guess it stacks up to ten ten shots, and then it triggers the EMP and resets the. The timer. So you see my uh, time down there is draining, and you see my health rate at 22.6. So it's weird. Um, I gotta test this out a bit more. But I'm um, sorry. I, I didn't need a holster like this actually. I'm trying to test this this holster out as well with the high end build. So I'll keep that. But then let's go test this out one more on another boss. Down here. Cause I guess if I test on these two dudes right here, don't you? He might even die from it. That's five shots on him. Then we do five shots on the other. Well, I say it's it, look, it's easier you see, it's it gotta be consecutive. Oh. See, it doesn't trigger. You have to hit the same target. Ten times. Get on my face, boy. You gotta hit the same target ten times. So if I uh, do the three, obviously I'm not. I'm not intending to apply the mark. But there's a bus right here. I'll show you. Uh, so it looks like you can't like try and uh, hit multiple uh, targets with it. If you know what I mean? You can't shoot one target and then uh, try to shoot another. You know the boss sometimes you get the uh, EMP effect. I don't know if he can shoot his plans with his EMP, but... What? Right. Go with the EMP. Yeah. He just keeps stacking the EMP on him. Maybe he can't. Oh yeah, he can. No, he can't. <laughs> he can, my boy. What you doing? You playing with fire. Literally. I know you got the mask and whatnot, but... Playing with the fire. Or maybe... Yeah, he, he still can. 
So I guess it, it works best on players that chuck the nades or things like that. It stops them from using it. But you see, my weapon damage is crazy. This is, this is, uh, so it looks like it, looks like it resets itself, take with that, after 10 shots, and put your weapon damage, oh, destructive, deadly, and swift, I'm gonna keep that, cause I am trying out the LMG, I might get competent on the bottom, actually, destructive, deadly, destructive, and competent with the LMG, yeah, it could be nice, but, um, this holster, I would say the best way to set this holster up is with a sentry. And look, it starts. It starts now. They gave me a sentry piece. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to utilize it. I'm going to use it. So I'm going to have to start collecting my sentry again. And I'll, um, when I get my sentry, that is when I get it, then uh, I will give you all a full breakdown of whether it is good with the sentry shield build or not good at all so this is just a, a rev, a just a showcase of it basically and um yeah so i can see it being good with a sentry shield build that's if you're good with the shields so um i'd say now i'll, re I'll release a, another video once i get the four uh, four piece sentry pieces i want um and then I'll use the kernel bus holster and that's and I'll give y'all another overall view on this holster. But um I thank you guys for watching. I'm sorry it's been a long video. But um if you guys are looking for where you get the holster, you do get it at the general assembly mission. That's where it drops, has a drop rate from the boss, Colonel Bliss. But you can um you can get it from the full proficiency cache. That's what I got mine from. So um, if you do want to test this out, um, go ahead, farm that mission. Let's enjoy yourself, man. But um, I hope you enjoy your Christmas season, enjoy winter season, people. And I shall see y'all on the next one. Peace.